Previously on Batman. Ah, Christmas. The day of giving. And in this case, giving a foot up somebody's ass. What the? Grab the hostages! You, you seeing this? What the hell is that thing? Some kind of death wish? I should use my smoke pellets here. Wake up. You didn't see anything. Oh no! Oh, 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 oh. What? I didn't know we left America and went to China. I'm looking for black. Where is it? The sign is on. I'm going to kick your ass. If you say so, buddy. Goodbye. Ow, no, maybe son. not. You know you ain't welcome here. And you know what we do to Trish Bosses? Well, you're about to find out. Oh God, oh God, oh God, oh God, oh God. Go get the bed. Shut up, leave me alone, go fuck yourself. You want some of I wanna go home. Well then you should have left before coming towards me. Okay, now I'm leaving. Yourself, you low class gore. One more word. Oh God. Hey, how you doing over there? You you having a good day? And I'll just take you out real quick. Oh, 
And last one. What do you want? I didn't do nothing. Who's your boss? What does Penguin want with him? Alberto Falcone. But I got no idea what Penguin wants with him, I swear. I don't know what your game is, but old man Falcone will be in your debt if you take Cobblepot down. He's right through that door back there. No thanks. I don't need the Falcones in my debt. Now, where were we? Candy. You suggested little Alberto over here. Hey, baby. Tried to convince his father to take early retirement. He disagreed and called you a, let's see, psychotic little bastard. No, 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 please! <laughs> <laughs> Oh, you best listen, Falcone. Because this is the last time I'll ask. What are you gonna tell your father? That we're getting out of the weapons business. I promise. I'll make him do it. <laughs> I see your lips flapping, Bernie. But they ain't making the sound I want to hear. You idiots better keep Please, don't hurt me. You. It's gonna be a long. Punch him in the face. I don't want to be punched in the facial expression. I'm about to just shut the hell up and let's fight.
Ow. Shit. I am absolutely whooping this dude's ass. Ow! I spoke too soon. Slade kind of looks like um, Snake from Metal Gear Solid. It's kind of weird. I can't let Penguin get away. That was a very nervous laugh of I didn't like that, but I'm going to allow it because he'll kill me. <laughs> oh yeah. Deathstroke's device to get up to the balcony. That's not a jolly. Alfred, see if you can find any information on a murder at Lacey Towers. Hmm, looks like the police are on the scene now, sir. Oh, and this is interesting. They're saying Black Mask is the victim. Black Mask dead. I'm on my way there now. Use the device I took from Deathstroke. I already have. Alfred, 
Get GCPD to take a look at the final offer. More to Dixon docks. They'll find Slade Wilson tied up and waiting for them. Along with some of Penguin's illegally obtained weapons. Uh, another anonymous pip? Will do, sir. Huh. Oh, okay, then. Citizens of Gotham, your cries for help have been heard. I am Anarchy, voice of the people, here to save you from uh, I thought you were somebody with uh, Chop or Antifa or whatever the fuck Those they're gonna try and call themselves this week. And safe won't lift a finger. And why would they? They've been bought and paid for, encouraged to turn a blind eye. If they won't act, I will. Yeah. At dawn's first light, the sources of Gotham's ruin will be destroyed now back to your regularly scheduled programming of propaganda and consumerist garbage as if there isn't enough going on tonight that's probably what the people of seattle thought i should hurry to lacy towers oh, the gonna be <laughs> the evidence from the crime scene <laughs> Hello, Oh shit. See, I've got a story to tell you. It's about crime and violence. Greed and vengeance. But it's also a story of redemption. Of second chances. Of change. I've planted three bombs where Gotham's corruption is at its strongest. But unlike those I fight to overthrow, I believe in choice. So, I offer you one. Let them detonate or stop them. Your actions will determine what I do with you. I've planted three bombs where Gotham's corruption is... Whoa, whoa, easy now. I ain't looking for a fight. I've got a message, that's all. Anarchy says if you're gonna make a withdrawal, you better do it soon. Let them detonate. Oh, Your actions will determine what I do with you. Guess what? That's how capitalism works. And it's probably one of the best things in the world. Because that's the only way people get rich. Let's get on it. investigating this crime should have a relay station set up. It'll look like a mobile satellite dish, probably on a rooftop. Get away from the edge, you idiot. blew him off the edge get away from the edge there's too many police dying as it is we don't need more and I don't need to be the cause of one Rubio what's your 20 
On the balcony for a smoke with a menace. Those men on the balcony, that could be my way in. Yeah, we got Penguin now. I'd like to see him squirm out of this one. Fingerprints, two dead bodies. He's about to lose some time. Oh, God. Get wrecked! Police believe Penguin murdered Black Mask, but why would he send me here if he was the killer? It doesn't add up. Jet. This crime took place days ago. The fire and the exposure to the elements make identifying the victims difficult. The male victim is wearing a black mask. But I can't positively identify him as Roman Cyanus without a DNA analysis. Something I can't do in the field. I can identify the female victim based on her fingerprints. Tiffany Ambrose, Roman Cyanus' girlfriend. Or one of them, at least. She was no angel. Long list of priors. But nothing to indicate she was the target here. The fire spread as a result of a Molotov cocktail thrown into the room. It may have been intended to destroy evidence. The shallow trajectory of the bullet suggests the shooter could be someone of Penguin's height. But the grooves on the floor suggest that the victim was killed by someone leaning back in a chair. This bullet was fired from a revolver. Ballistics analysis indicates a low angle of trajectory. The shooter could have been someone of Penguin's height. But the pattern in the gunpowder residue suggests the bullet was actually fired by someone lying on the ground. These fingerprints are a match for the penguin, but they're on top of the soot from the fire. The cops were right. Penguin was in the room. But these prints prove he was here after the murders were committed. If he didn't kill Black Mask, who did? The only thing I know for certain is that Tiffany's shooter was lying on the floor. But why? These white streaks are shoe polish. Whoever shot Tiffany was being dragged along the floor. Besides the victims, there were two other people in the room. Tiffany's shooter, and whoever was dragging the shooter. The location from which the male victim was shot may tell me more. The DNA here doesn't belong to either of the victims. Whose is it? The fight broke out when someone startled the shooter. It's not clear who won the fight. Could have been either one of them. I should review the evidence to see if I can learn anything more about either the intruder or the shooter. Fabric analysis indicates the intruder was wearing a white suit or sport jacket. This fabric swatch could help identify the intruder, but I still can't identify the male victim's shooter. There's one impact area I haven't checked for clues.
items. Let me do that. This DNA is from the female victim. The level of oxidation suggests Good Lord. For several days. That's at least a concussion. If I review the evidence. I may be able to find out what she was doing when she was attacked. She was sending text messages to Roman Sionis about someone named the Joker. Someone killed Black Mask. But this crime took place several days ago, and I saw Black Mask earlier tonight. The answers I have raise more questions. Who is the Joker? Was he the killer here? Or is he one of the assassins? I have a body, an unknown shooter, and an unknown assailant who attacked the shooter. I need to match the DNA samples against the records in the National Criminal Database to identify who was in the room. Okay. Alfred, I need access to the National Criminal Database. Well, the only way to do that would be to infiltrate the Gotham City Police Department. Then that's where I'm going. Sir, you'd need to physically hack into their servers. If you insist on doing something that foolish, you'll need a powerful, non-lethal weapon. I recommend coming back here to pick up your concussion detonator. Not a bad idea. Alrighty. I was about to say, oh, they didn't send you to money? Alright. Whatever. Bring it, bitch. Mercy. Okay. Take that. Eight two. Come in, eight two. Dispatch, Delta four four. Can you raise Delta eight two? Welcome home, sir. The concussion detonator is on your workbench. Remember, if you use that instead of your fists, you'll do less lasting damage to those police officers and civil servants. Noted. Well played, sir. You stopped the electrocutioner with a single strike. I just used his arrogance to my advantage. A textbook move a child could have avoided. True, but I doubt the rest of them will go down as easily. If they do, we'll be eating that Christmas ham sooner than you think. Hey guys, thanks for watching this video. If you liked it, please hit the like button. It does help my channel grow. And if you want to see more content from my channel, please subscribe, hit the bell to make sure that you're notified. And I'll see you guys next time.